Hello everyone, it's Olivia from Cute as a Bow, and today I have a very quick and easy back to school hairstyle for everyone. I do want to apologize ahead of time because it is thundering and lightning like crazy out, and if you hear any just crashing noises, then that's probably the reason why. But anyway, this is really great for when you're in the car and you don't really have time to futz around with your hair in front of a mirror. And all you have to know is how to twist your hair and a three-strand braid. So let's get started. All right, so to begin this hairstyle, I'm just going to start off by telling you guys that I do have my normal side part here and if your hair is parted in the center of your head then I suggest moving the part a little maybe farther to the side so now I'm going to take some hair from the heavy side of that part make sure you grab you don't want to grab too much hair but you also want it not too thin I guess and now I'm going to divide this hair into two equal pieces. And I'm going to be just twisting these two pieces of hair together. I'm not really tightening it hard. I'm just letting them loosely fall. And this is not a rope braid. I'm braiding it, just kind of twisting it. So this is the easy part. I'm just going to pin the twist in the back of my head. And if you don't have a pin with you, then you can use your teeth to hold it. But now I'm going to take the rest of my hair and pull it to the side where my twist has started. And I'm going to be dividing this hair into three equal parts. There we go. Make that as even as possible. All right, so now I'm going to unclip the twist. And I'm going to take this twist and I'm going to put it in the middle section of my braid. All right, and I'm just going to add it in. And now, of course, I'm going to start a regular three-strand braid by crossing both the left and the right strands over the middle. And I'm just going to continue this all the way down to the ends of my hair. Alright, I'm not quite finished yet, and that's because I want it to be easy to pull the edges of the braid to kind of pancake them and to make them fluffier. You don't have to do this if you don't want to. Alright, so this looks okay, and now I'm going to secure it with an elastic. There we go. And I'm just going to come back here and fluff my braid out. And there we go. That is your quick and easy hairstyle. Well, everyone, unfortunately, that is all I have for today, but I hope you enjoyed my tutorial on the nested twist back into a braid. Like I said before, I think this is super easy for when you're running late, not just for school, but for any other occasion, and I think it looked really cute in the end, and yet it's still very simple. So, I will see everyone later. Goodbye!